So we look at uh, the determinant of a two by two matrices. We are saying the determinant is a difference between the product of elements of major diagonal and my and the minor diagonal. So this means that uh, the, the determinant is the difference of the product of the, the elements of the major diagonal. The major diagonal, if we have these elements, okay, we have A, B, C, D. So these, these elements are known as the major, major diagonal, okay? These are major diagonal. Then these, these elements are known as the, the minor diagonal. So these are minor diagonal. These are major diagonal. So the product, this means that you multiply these elements which are in the major diagonal. Then you subtract the product of the minor diagonal. So we have the example here. We are saying, rather before we go to the example, we have this. It is denoted by date. So if you see this in your exam, either in paper 1 or paper 2, you are trying to say find date A, it means that you are finding the determinant. Or if they put things like this, okay, for example, we have this. If they write like this, like the way we are seeing this, it means that you are finding the determinant of that matrix. If you have been given like this, it means that you are finding the determinant of that matrix. So this is what we have. Now, let's look at the examples given. Example number A, where we have been told that uh, matrix R is equal to the first row is 4, 2. Those are the elements. The second row, 6 and 4. So date, date, date R is equal to the product of the major diagonal, meaning we are going to have 4 multiplied by 4, then minus the product of the minor diagonal, 2 multiplied by 6. So we are going to have get R is equal to 16 minus 12. So get R will be 4. So this is the answer for the determinant of matrix R. Let us now find the determinant of matrix P of question number B. Matrix B of, of matrix C, matrix P. So we are having that P is equal to, we are going to have the, the product of the major diagonal, which is 2 multiplied by 4 minus the product of the minor diagonal, which is negative 2 multiplied by 4. So, that P is equal to 8 minus negative 8. So, this is what we have. So, we are going to have that P is equal to 8 plus 8. Then we have that P is equal to 16. So, the determinant of P is 16. The determinant of P is 16. Let us now look at question number C. So question number C, we are finding the determinant of Q. So we are going to say that Q, that Q is equal to negative 4 multiplied by 3 minus negative 2 multiplied by negative 5 in brackets. So we are going to have negative 4 multiplied by 3. We have negative 12. Negative 12 minus negative 2 multiplied by negative 5. We are going to have positive 10. So therefore, we are going to have that Q is equal to Negative 12 minus 10. We are going to have negative 22. So this marks the end of 
question number C, which is the determinant of Q. Thank you so much. So we end here. We will continue uh, with other subtopics under matrices of which we are going to look at, uh, at them in the next video. Thank you so much.